Warning, this is not a how-to, step-by-step, or instructional channel. We are not professionals. Everything you see is real and not rehearsed. Following our instructions may result in you redoing the job over. Enjoy. Hey all, welcome back to Jugger Clunkers. I am Grady, your host as normal. We've got Brent the Technician. Another relic of the channel. Our tractor. So uh, tractor we did back in those springtime. Got it running pretty good, played with it. I uh, put it in my driveway, ran it a couple times, moved some stuff. It then developed a radiator leak. That's my brother. So it, it then developed a radiator leak, um, which we were we were pretty sure it was going to leak, but the radiator leak was because of me. I didn't actually bolt it down, and I didn't think about it until it was too late. And coming up and down the back part of the property over here, and things flexing, the radiator went into the fan, and well, it, it wasn't good. Um, I bought a radiator off a website that I probably shouldn't have. They scammed me. They sent me a pair of socks. The socks don't even fit. So I talked to them. They said, oh, whoa, 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 we'll send you the radiator. And they never sent me the radiator. I had to buy another one. I haven't even opened that package, and it's been here for, what, two, three months? So I'm really hoping that it's going to fit because I don't think that I can... Uh, I can get the uh, refund back on that because it's, it's been sitting in the package in the office. So um, it did run out of gas, I hope, or it lost spark. And I actually ended up pushing it into the spot that you see here. And it's been here literally probably about two weeks after the last video was posted. Maybe a little more. So let's fill up with gas. Let's uh, throw a jump pack on it, see if she'll fire back up. I'm sure it will. It'll be fine. Right, Brent? Yeah. I'm going to make a mess. Hello, brother. Is this thing ready for me to drive yet? <laughs> Why do I have stickers? Hi, stickers! Probably. I just hope it's going to run right again. That's all I'm hoping. Oh, well, there's Bella, there's Blue. And Snickers. Here you go, Brent. That way we have a little bit of gas in case we need it for something else. Hey, I almost took the camera out. Stop! Hey! Why are no, they out? No, stop! They're trying to get the camera. Why are they out? I don't know. Stop! No!
Oh, All right, guys. We got the tractor sitting out here. We're getting ready to replace the radiator. I figure before uh, we go taking that radiator out, we'll check this one. This is um, an eBay radiator. Wasn't that cheap. Haven't opened it. Been sitting in our, our office for quite a while. Brent said he wants to open it. Brent, don't stick a knife through the radiator, please. I'll try my best. You gotta try harder than that, son. Oh, you can't see you. Open it. The box did have a, a hole in it, so it made me a little nervous. Let's take this plastic off. Okay. Yeah, that's okay. There's, I don't see any hole holes in it. Like anything that will leak? Yeah. It looks pretty good. It looks correct. So let's start tearing into this radio, this uh, this track day. Track day! it is guys is it's a hose here hose at the bottom and then two two studs that come sticking down through the radiator on the bottom I'm gonna have Brett crawl under there and start taking what? those off what 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 and uh, yeah so let's just get going a little bit of technical difficulty over here. I shall figure it out though. guys not sure if you can see that that's the fan making contact that's my fault she junk she junk Those are all nice and cleaned up. Let's get this thing installed. All right, let's see if we can drop these bolts a million and a half times. Oh, there goes a rubber thingy. Already? Yeah, I think I'm gonna take the bolts off for now. I'm gonna try and put them on when I get it down in there more. Well, you know, it didn't have to be a burr bunghole all the time, was it? Damn. 
this. I might need you to come hold that. One's big and one's small, but they'll both fit. What do you need to hold what? The radiator so it doesn't fall. Okay. Over here. I'm just trying to make it so it's not going to smash into stuff. So just, just watch it. down what okay hold on is that where it's supposed to sit nope oh. not fully okay. that one is yeah. hold on sorry it's just hard to hold there's another bolt here oh. just watch it i don't want to i don't know where that other piece of rubber went okay you no because i can't let go of this you're hitting something uh, i'm trying not to oh. okay i need that other piece of rubber okay Ground, sure, I'm sure. Like one of those square pieces? Yeah. Well, ground, sure. Where were you? Going? It was under my foot, actually. Kind of funny, isn't it? Mm. It was under my foot. Okay. Do I have to lift this up again? Just lift it up slightly. Okay, I'm trying to make sure the fins don't touch anything. Oh, oh shit, you came out too. Ah. Oh. Okay, oh, oh. Start coming down. Okay. I'm. Yeah. I, do I put this pipe on? What pipe? No. Oh. Okay. Are we? Uh oh. Are we not? It's fine on something. You should be fine. Yeah, you're fine. Okay, give me... You were just hitting the pipe right here a little. There's two nuts over there by the bag and the... I know. Washers. Great. I need that damn 16. There's got to be an easier way. Now, I didn't take this radiator off, but he's just about tight on those bolts on the bottom. And it's still got some flip-floppity. And I don't want this darn thing going back into the, the fan. So I think we're going to have to make a uh, bracket come off in there and hook onto this. I don't know. I'll think on it for a little bit and probably get back to you in the morning. What's Bellaby got? You got your tree. You got a tree. You got a tree. That one Snickers. And it's blue. Do Snickers. Hi, Snickers. You heard ball, didn't you, buddy? Snickers, do you want a ball? Where's your ball? Don't tell me yet. Shelby, want to come play? It's about to get loud, guys. Oh, no. Blue man. You smelled it. Blue. Blue yeah, man. You know. Bluesy. Come say hi to the camera. Come say hi to the camera. Come say hi to the camera. Oh, Shelby, you going to come say hi to the camera, too? They're gonna play. Hi, Shelby. I don't think Blue has ever seen the ball can in handy. Uh, I don't think he's ever seen it. I don't know, but this is gonna get loud. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> now, just a warning, everybody. He's not hurt, injured, or anything. He just makes a lot of noise. Stop! Now! <laughs> and I'm not talking about Brent. <laughs> Come oh on. no, Snickers! I oh, found a way in. <laughs> run, Brent, run! <laughs> they took the ball out of it. And now to go. Snickers, draw! Draw! He's so excited. 
He doesn't see the ball at all. Shelby! Jimmy! Put it in! Put it in! So we've got the radiator installed as you can see but we've still got some still got some play here so what I want to do is just build a bracket to go through that that bolt there down angle and then down so that's what we're gonna go cut out right now <laughs> Start. All right, guys, what do you think? I think I'm going to pound that down a little bit hello yeah I'm gonna pound that down a little bit I think I think it's good. I don't think she's gonna go nowhere, guys. Nice and sturdy. I'm pretty sure we've already tightened up all our lines. So, I suppose the next thing to do is start adding some cooling. Yes, Bella, I hear you.
little for you, and a little for me. But I sure do love my teas. I'm going to go ahead and say that that's probably good for right this minute. We're going to cap this off. We're going to leave that open so it can do its gurgle gurgle thing. Didn't even notice me. Shame on you, Michael. Didn't even say good morning. Anyhow, we have another project to do. So, if you remember, we... Ooh. Man, it's still got a lot of condensation on her. We, uh, we took the valve cover off because we wanted to find out if we had any, anything stuck up here. Guys, it's still not great. not great at all it's still a lot of water in this block and look at this not good at all what do we do to get the water out just run it I want to know if there's any water in this block right now at the bottom Let's go do that right now. We're gonna drain the oil. All right, guys, I'm definitely bummed about the whole condensation in the motor still. Uh, I'm going to keep pushing forward, though. I've got... He's up. He's going upstairs. He's going upstairs. That's That's something for a neighbor to tell me. All right, um, so definitely bummed a little bit there because I thought we had we'd gotten rid of all that. And it's kind of making me second guess if uh, this has got a blown head gasket. So I'm just going to clean this up now. Clean this mating surface up. Get this valve cover done, finish up the oil change, start it up for a while, run it. We're going to have to do another oil change before winter, guys. Um, and we're going to have to test this head gasket. Definitely not in the mood I was 20 minutes ago. I like this tractor quite a bit. I really don't want to see head gasket in its future so i don't want to do that much work to be honest with you to it i like it and all but i think if it needs that much work she'll probably be going down the road and fyi if you're interested this tractor is for sale i have learned that it is uh too much tractor for my little property that i have <clears throat> So if you are interested, reach out. I am in New Hampshire. I'm in the Lakes region. So remember that kind of stuff when you're reaching out because I will not deliver it. I do not have a truck anymore. So delivery will be on 
you and you only. Just cleaning up the valve cover. Not sure it's something you all want to see. It's kind of boring. Uh, so we got this offline. Part number 133957 kit. Deck wheel kit is what it's called. It's made in India. Oh, okay. Had this for quite some time. Looks right. Looks correct on Mondo. Some crease some crow. I did not put that thing on that tight. Jeez, I'm cross. God damn. The damn thing is on there. Let's hear those comments. Don't do that. You don't want to do that. You're going to do something bad. Oh, so bad. This motor is just full of water. Even after all those oil changes. Should I do Bluetooth? Bluetooth funnel? Probably not gonna happen, is it? We'll give it a shot. Oopsie, oopsie. I'm gonna put four, roughly four quarts in it. Boy, I'm doing pretty good. Sit here for a full time. I just want you to hear that 
motor sounds so good. Trying to get some heat into her. Hasn't run since the last time we uh, really messed with it. Uh, and even still, we haven't put much heat into it at all. So I'm going to mess with this off camera for a while. And uh, I'll bring you back if anything comes up. Uh, I do have some other things I want to do to it. We might order, we might order some lights. Uh, yeah, see if we can find other tractor stuff that we want to put on it. Because uh, I think we're going to end up keeping it unless somebody says, "Hey, I got to have that." You know, they got to pay me the money. Otherwise, we'll keep it to move shit around. So. Like I said, I'm going to do some adjustments on it, mess with it, we'll bring you back if we find anything cool. If not, it'll we'll probably skip to something else on the on the list of stuff we had to do to her. Alright guys, we got pallets to move, so we're going to pick them up and bring them over closer to the, uh, the house.
All right, guys. As promised, we've bought forks for the tractor. You want a knife? Yeah. Uh, and we're gonna uh, we're gonna install them. This is not a paid endorsement or anything. I get these off Amazon. If they're any good, I'll put a link in the description uh, later on. Not anytime soon. I, I want to make sure things are, are decent before I before I say, hey, they're good, you know? Put them right in the bucket. Here. I don't know. Oh my goodness. Yeah. Oh, oh. Who's this? Spare parts. What the? Helpage. Well, I mean, there we go. Oh, I got steel toes. These look pretty easy to install. Maybe we will double them up. I don't really trust just one. Yeah. <laughs> I'm not quite sure on them either. Like I said, before I go and endorse anything, I want to... We want to put them apart. You don't want to put them close so we can put the chain over both of them? What is this? Hold on. How does this work? Oh, that looks like it would kind of go over the end, end of it. Yeah, so... Looks like you go something like this. I see what you mean here. Yeah. Yep. You put it right there, and then we'll put the chain through the middle of it. I like the design so far. And this goes. I think this is supposed to go back here. Hopefully, this camera can see us good. That could go as wide as we need it to. And then this can go wherever we want. These are a little smaller than I was imagining, like in length. Oh, I didn't know I had a hook there. Hook there too. <laughs> side to side, they're not very. I don't know what the hell are you gonna lift with this. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> That's good. An LS. <laughs> yeah.
Show the bucket. guys there you have it newest video about the tractor uh we've got it <laughs> running again <laughs> uh the radiator was absolutely my fault i should have built that little bracket to hold it but i didn't think about it i was too excited back when we got it to, to make it correct but anyhow that's taken care of valve covers not leaking anymore i am really concerned about the the water in the motor i, I don't know if it's just the the remnants of when it was full of water when we got it or if it's still getting in somehow because uh, i don't have a lean to or anything like that uh i do i do plan on building something um, that might be able to help preserve this a little bit better but that's a future future project uh these forks, so far, so good. As you can see, we were able to pick up a motor a lot easier um, than trying to hook it to the bucket. And, hey, it, it, it's working. So, hopefully you guys are enjoying the channel. I, I really hope that, you know, everybody can, can smash that like button. Make sure you subscribe, share it out to the friends. You know, we've got like 70% of you guys are not subscribed. It's free. Why not get it done? It really helps me out, and it brings you better content, you know. Because when YouTube thinks I'm doing better, when they, you know, they, they know I'm a good guy, they're gonna push me more. That means that I'm gonna be able to to be able to grow, you know. And entail you guys grow with me. Um, we also have memberships. If you guys are interested in that, I'm still working out all the details on it, and I would love to hear what you guys would love to see through a membership. Whether it's a once monthly live, um, like a one to one, just between my memberships and, and myself and, and, and my crew, um, or, or, or something, just anything. Just let me know what you guys think. I'm open for any ideas, um, and if the prices are too high, let me know. I'll see if I can I'll see if I can work on that. I know there's a way to, to adjust prices, but um, like I said, that's gonna do it for this video. I really appreciate each and every one of you. Let's keep growing. I got some really cool projects coming. The Mustang, I know. Hey, it's still in the garage. We're going to get it done. Uh, it's just we've got a lot of stupid little crap we're trying to get done as normal. The Mustang always takes the back, you know, the back seat. I, I don't know why, guys. It's it's a lot of work that I've never done. So that's uh, just trying to be honest with you. Thing we are going to get to it this winter because it's going to be crappy outside, and I'm not going to want to work outside. So let's get uh let's wrap this one up. Appreciate every one of you once again. Like, share, subscribe, or don't. <laughs>